Hey guys and welcome back to another Project Cars 2 episode. We're back in career mode and we did not do very well in the last race. If you didn't see the video you should go watch it. Kind of a couple mistakes on my part and we ended up finishing fairly low in the order. However what that did set up is an epic last race standings battle between me and Garnett Lee. He's got one point on me, I'm right behind him and our, there's also a Fairly close championship battle between the two um, constructors, so we'll see how that turns out. But he is definitely going to be my number one rival as we run into this. So we're going to jump into practice, and we'll give you the results on how that went, and uh, we'll go from there. Okay, guys, that was the end of practice around Texas Motor Speedway infield course. It's a fairly short course, as you can see the lap time is sub 40 seconds and conveniently mr lee is right there half a second behind me so this is uh stepping up and looks like it's going to be a fairly entertaining race so now i'm going to jump off to qualifying and we'll see how that turns out all right here we go flying lap let's see if we can actually get a half decent lap time in here Breaking into corner one, slowing down into second gear, riding it out, holding the throttle, now pressing her in. Let's go, 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 go. Get a good little exit out of here. Stay a little wide and then turn in. Make sure we don't clip the grass there. Stay in third gear, gun it the whole way through. Don't lift, don't lift. Okay, coming in here, brake a little bit early. Stay to the inside, second gear, get the car to rotate. And back on the gas, heavy, heavy, heavy. Push, 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 push. And a little bit of a Z corner here. Flick. And that is our one lap through. And what does that give us? It gives us pole position. Okay, guys, that was the end of qualifying. And again, we come out on pole. We're ahead of Garnet Lee by four tenths of a second. And that's really the only person we really have to care about because they're battling with us for the championship. So here we go, this is going to be a tight one between the two of us, off to the race. Okay, gotta get a good start off here. Go, 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 oh, that was, it's not as quick as we needed it to be, and that was a short shift. But that's okay, because we got the inside which should carry us through this corner and have no issues. We got 12 laps of this, no mistakes. It's more of a mental battle than an actual battle on the racetrack. We got Garnett Lee right behind us. And there we go, already off. That is not what we needed to do. Holy cow. We're right back in it right into the mess of things. I just pushed too hard in the last corner, didn't break early enough. And now we're chasing Mr. Lee to try and get back our championship. Just as I said, it's more of a mental battle than an actual battle on the racetrack. I go and make a mental mistake. But we do have tons of time to catch it all back up. We don't have to do it on the first couple laps, but the closer we get to the end, the closer we are to them now, will be the closer we'll be to Lee in the end and be able to take our position back and win our championship. You just gotta be very smart. Oh, I know, we're gonna get this guy. He doesn't stand a chance. He's gonna defend. We're gonna break early. And we're gonna kind of give him the space back. I thought maybe we could have pulled the move, but we didn't set up right for it. Bit of a dive bomb. Not quite into the corner, but definitely we're breaking much later than we needed to. These are very quick laps, so all 12 of these are going to go by very fast. We're already on the fourth lap here. Oh, way too far in the braking. Locked him up and slid right through. I mean, I got through, but that was a very, very scrappy pass, and, and I would be very upset if someone passed me like that. 
but that does get us through and we're on to chase down first and second here. They are within our grasp. We definitely can get these guys. We just have to make a little bit more of a cleaner pass than what we did. We're not out here playing bumper cars. Okay, here we go, up the inside. Perfect, so that gives us the inside for this corner. And he should have to slow down. Oh, no, he stays right in there. But he bumps us, and we get out okay. A little too fast into this last corner. Almost make the same mistake we did last time. And now, it's just me and Mr. Lee. He's only uh, 0.7 seconds ahead of us, and we're looking to change that. He's down to about half a second, but then again, the guy behind us is only half a second behind us. Maybe we can go through this section not actually having to battle anybody and gain a lot of time on Mr. Lee. We do, and we might be able to push a move up here on the inside. We're going to go for it. Oh yes, there we go, perfect. I mean, we kind of bullied our way back up here, but I'll take that. Really, it was only passing the third place guy. That was kind of an egregious move. But now, we just have five more laps to keep our cool. And again, just hold back and try not to make any mental mistakes and just drive a nice clean race to the end if we make a mistake at this point that'll be it we will not have time to recover we are getting a, a good distance on mr. Lee though we got them about a second behind us anything that we can gain and claw now we'll just make the later laps that little bit more enjoyable and less pressure Ooh, a little bit too much of a drift through that guy. Want to stay away from drifting. We want to maintain control of the car. A nice little set of corners there. Fairly well taken. Back into the brakes. Back down to second gear. A little bit wider than I like to take it. And Mr. Lee is within a second again. So that obviously was not a rather quick lap for us. We just have to do a little bit better. But we don't have to push it to the point where we're going to go too fast into corners. We just have to maintain our steady pace, maintain our composure, just not make any mental mistakes. It's really this section of the track here that I can really get a good gap on them because they do slow down quite a bit through that section. Mr. Lee still is within a second behind us so he's definitely keeping us honest. Oh yeah. Do I have magic? I don't know if I have magic. I usually call it luck. But yeah, we'll see what we can do. Nothing silly though. The gap is about half a second now. So he's definitely staying right there on us. He's keeping the pressure on. Keeping us honest. Making sure we don't make any significant mistakes that he can capitalize on. See that he is getting much closer. I was breaking way too early for that corner. Mr. Lee is now back there. He's putting on the pressure. I just have to respond.
Here we go. He's only half a second back. We'll see. We'll see if he uh, pushes harder here. I don't want to give him the inside. He is. He was kind of looking for it. I just have to make sure we're clean and we don't give him any chances here. No mistakes. Come through here, clean back on the gas, and that should be it. There we go. Get in there. Yes. Winning out the race, first place with the mistake, coming through to the end. Oh man, that was a close one. That was a better battle. That was, I mean, he wasn't quite there up beside us, but he was at least keeping us honest the whole way, which is better than what we've had so far. So we'll have to continue with that as the rest of the drivers here close in. My teammate ends up in fifth place, so that should be enough for us to take the championship as well uh, as we do both beat out the Team Southern cars. Let's continue and let's see what's there. There we go, 31 points. I did get the fastest lap as well, so I do grab an extra point there as well. And the team picks up 51 points, solidifying a driver's championship for me and a team championship for my team. 105 to 101. That was a lot closer than it needed to be. If I just would have done better in the in the third race and not finish 11th, it probably would have been an easier walkthrough, but it definitely made for a more exciting race at the end. Okay, Formula Rookie US Championship. First place, three podiums, three wins, 105 total points. Congratulations, you've successfully completed this series. You can now advance to the next in this series. Retry the series from the beginning or try an alternate series in the same bracket if available. You've earned the following accolade. One Formula US Rookie Championship. You can keep track of your accolades earned from the progress tab or your career dashboard. Okay, so now we can either do the Asia, UK, or jump to the Euro. I think we should jump to the Euro, seeing that we won that. And we have five races in uh, the schedule for the Euro Championship. So we're going to advance to that right now. You can see there, Autodrome International. Yeah, okay, sure. Whatever that place is. But that's where we're going to be next. And we're going to have to fight against all of these other individuals i'm not sure who's all in this team hopefully these are going to be much more tighter races should be pretty good but uh that's where i'm going to end this episode guys thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one